Hey guys, welcome back to Big Lou TV. So the island you've chosen your entry for Eurovision this year, 2024. So I know you had your final last night, so this is going to be the first time for me listening to the entry you've chosen. Though I will say I have seen a picture of this artist. She reminds me of a uh, Zool from the top of the Ghostbusters tower. Um, but yeah, let's see what she's dressed as in the live performance. So it should be interesting. Yes, what's in store for my Big Lou score? Let's listen. There we go. All scary. Like a doll. A creepy doll. Ooh. Attitude. Oh, I like her. Oh. Oh, it's freaky. She knows she's living a lie. Oh, what the hell is it doing now? The song has changed. It's like a soft pop song now. Oh, it's light on the screen, isn't it? Oh. Doing a bit of choreography now. Wow, I mean, it's very unusual, isn't it? Oh, very unusual. I like the start of it. And um, it's a little bit um, off-putting, though, isn't it? With the, the scary sort of sound and the sort of the teasing noise. And, and then parts here where she's probably like her verse. It's almost like she's talking it. Well, it's interesting, though. I like it. Like a poem. Oh. Oh. I. 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 She knows she's living a lie. This bit of the song, not as keen on. I do like what they're wearing, though. Doomsday Blue, there you go. Okay. Do all the things you do. Easy to remember. Oh, it's all gone red now. I like the colours. There's the ghosty sound there. That's a nice voice. Oh yes. Looks like she's building for this bit of the song. Like copyright break people. But very much enjoying this. Uh I don't know how Europe are gonna warm to it though. Um because it's very unusual and the song has lots of different levels to it, but that's good to keep people engaged. But it might might make people struggle to hook onto it potentially. But at least you've not sent a safe option island, you know, because that's not going to win you anything. So I think you've chosen well there. Eh? Oh, blue. <laughs> oh, got a bit of an instrumental now. Oh, it is. Oh, she's really moving dramatically now. Oh, God. Oh, she sounds in pain here. Oh. Wow. <laughs> I can see why the crowd reacted like that. Well, let's hear them there. Really going for it. Yeah. You go, girl. Yeah, we'll give you a round of applause ourselves. 
Very good. Yeah, I'm not surprised the presenter looked like that. <laughs> wow. Wow. Well. Very good, Ireland. It's the song, though, that I think you will prefer to watch live. So that's good. Eurovision is a TV show, first and foremost. And I don't know if I would add it to a playlist. But what I will say is, I will remember this song. And I remember what she looks like. Just think if Norway so send a goth minister, they'd get on well together, wouldn't they, them two? <laughs> um, and... Yeah, I mean, um, it's going to be hard to rate, though. The one thing I'll say about it is, like I say, it's not safe. And it's fun to watch. And, you know, I could imagine people dressing up as her for Halloween. And actually, the fans themselves. A lot of people were dressing up as Karia last year. And um, we have very distinctive clothes. She does as well. I imagine, especially a lot of the female fans trying to dress up as her, definitely, uh, and um, it will get people talking. You're not gonna, you're not gonna forget this. And as Ireland, you struggle to qualify sometimes for the final. I think you'll be in the final with this. Yes, even though it's odd. And these are the sort of songs that can go viral, and sort of songs that can grab people's attention. So maybe. I want to say top 10 potential. I don't know if it'll get higher. But it might be too, too crazy for some people. I don't know. Give us your thoughts below. And actually, I need to give a score, don't I? So my Big Lou score, I will give it a... I'll give this a bit higher than I would because I think it's, it's nice for you to send a risk. So seven and a half score, yes, from me. Because it's pretty good and risky is 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 what we want. Because we don't want a boring Eurovision, do we? I think she's going to light up the stage. People will remember her. And straight away, I'm thinking, oh, Ireland. Well, you're never really on my radar. But I couldn't rule this out winning Eurovision. It's got something different about it. So, I think you've chosen very well. Give us your scores below. What do you think, people? Have I been too generous? Have I been not, not critical enough? Um, and, yeah. No, well, that's woke me up this morning. Yes. Right, well done, Ireland. Give us your thoughts below. I'll see you soon. Bye.